Welcome back. Girls action going on. We'll start in Georgetown on Thursday. Sussex Tech taking on St. Thomas Moore. Emily Truitt pulls up, hits one from distance. Sussex Central is going to cut into St. Thomas Moore's lead, but Anaya Patterson gets a layup to go, plus the foul. Then she would go off a few plays later, showing off the range here. The bank was open, even in a blizzard. Team high 13 <laughs> for her. Central making a serious game with this one. Truett is going to get the ball right here and pull up from three. They would cut the lead and actually tie this game up with 20 seconds left, but the Ravens have one last bucket in them. It would be Sasha Marvel, the freshman here, hits the go-ahead bucket on a dime with 20 seconds left. That would be the difference there. Central ends up dropping this one 56 to 60 for 53 to final. On the same night, we had, well, Cape at home taking on Lake Forest and attacking early on. Maya Maddox finds some space in the corner. And she'll go ahead and launch that one, and it'll drop in for three. But back comes the home team, Logan, Shuttle, Logan Shuttlesworth, that is, looking like Jesus Shuttlesworth with a pass over to Paige Moore. Finishes with 12 points. That was a game high. Lake would have the answer, though. Erica Burrell drives baseline. The floater drops in. Three-point lead at recess. Second half, and Cape would take over, though. Lexi Watkins kicks it over to Carly Truitt. She drives in and she gets that one to go amongst the trees as the Vikings would get the win, 55-44 to the final. Pokemoke versus Mardella. Pokemoke, very dominant in the base side, showing it off. Shayla Jones goes all the way inside, two of her 15 points. Mardella doing their best here to fight back. Here's Taylor Ross, the boss, for two points. She finished with team best 13 points. Later, it would be her teammate, Kayla Cook doing the honors, taking it all the way. Watch the smooth Euro step here. Ooh. Sweet finish here for the coach's kid. But this one was all about Pokemon from about the third quarter on. Ball gets swung around, finds Tamir the Shields, and she's going to find the bottom of the net. Ten points for the Shields. Pokemon leaves, no doubt. They win this one 64 to 35. And I'll tell you what, Spencer, I cannot wait for this next block. We got something very special for you guys on the way. Two guys making their DSI debut, meeting all star, NBA all star from Pokemon. I did not misspeak that. You have to see this story when we get back. I'm Grace Tunis, and I'm from WPS Basketball, and this is Delmarva Sports Insider.